Hello everybody, this is Coding Made Easy and um, this is an introduction to the, my OpenGL tutorials. Now, some of you may be asking what is OpenGL? Well, OpenGL stands for Open Graphics Library. So it's Open Source Graphics Library. And basically, it's, an, it's a graphics API to uh, make 3D and 2D games, but mainly 3D games and 3D applications and stuff like that. Um, I am, I kind of got into OpenGL a few months ago, but then I stopped with it, and I'm getting right back into it. So I'm kind of learning stuff in the beginning and stuff. So my ways of coding in OpenGL may not be the most effective but I'll tell you right now that my way of coding you will get the job done now the reason why I'm making these t tutorials with not as that much experience is because if I'm teaching from a beginner's perspective so you can relate to me so basically if you're a beginner and I'm a beginner we relate better rather than if I'm a pro at something then when I say something you might not be able to relate to it it might sound too sophisticated or too complicated for you for example if you're talking to a mathematician and you only know grade 9 math if you're talking about math to that mathematician he's gonna sound much more intelligent you're not gonna understand half the things he's saying so the same thing for right here I'm just gonna be teaching from what I know from a beginner's perspective so you can relate to me and better understand what you are programming in OpenGL and to make it even easier on you we're gonna be using OpenGL in a console application rather than Win, a Win32 application because Win32 can get pretty complicated it's like 50 lines just to create a window and if you watch my Lego tutorials, it's like, I don't know, 10 lines to make a window, maybe even less. So, Win32 is really hard and it has a lot of stuff that look kind of awkward and it's really hard to memorize. And as you can see, if you can see, like I tried to do some direct 3D, 3D tutorials and stuff, but DirectX um, uses the Win32 and Although I learned a bit of DirectX, I honestly find OpenGL easier and to be better because it's cross-platform and because um, DirectX can only play on Windows, so stuff that I made by Microsoft, so like on Xbox 360 and um, the PC, but it can't run on Mac or Unix or Linux or anything like that. OpenGL can run on all those programs except for, I don't think it can run on 360. I may be wrong, but that's just a little information. People may say that Op DirectX is better, but in my opinion, OpenGL is better and it requires less code. If you, if, since we're doing a console application, we're going to be using another library called Glut with it. And what Glut will allow us to do is to use some of the draw functions. So we won't need to use Win32. So to avoid Win32, then we use Glut, and it's really easy to get used to. I learned um, the functions and stuff, like the basic functions, in like less than 30 minutes. Like it's not, it's not really that hard. Well, maybe because I'm like a bit of an experienced programmer, but it shouldn't take too long. It shouldn't take more than days to learn, right? So if you know the basics of C++ and stuff, and you want to jump right into 3D programming, then go ahead. Might be a little bit complicated, requires a bit of math, but not all that much. And I don't want this video to be too long, so next video I'm going to be showing you how to uninstall it, and how to do a basic program, and I hope you enjoy these tutorials. So thanks for now, and bye.